This $20 accessory will make you a better watchmaker. In watchmaking, seeing what you're doing is imperative. I recently bought this binocular microscope and it helped me immensely. But whether you're working under the scope or using a loop, you know the importance of great lighting. I use this desk lamp to put diffuse light exactly where I need it. Since I do video for my YouTube channels, I have plenty of light in my workspace mounted above. On the microscope, there's an adjustable ring light, which guarantees adequate illumination on the smallest of subjects. If we lived in a world where all watch parts were opaque, I'd be set because all of these lighting sources are basically top down. Look at this bridge plate through the microscope. What nice detail. But in watchmaking, nice simply isn't good enough sometimes. You strive for perfect. And this $20 video light can help you get there. Back to the microscope and we have a pretty good look at the jewels. Now check this out. With the video light brightness turned down to about 20, check out how we can see the jewels. Let's add some top illumination with the ring light, and wow, every piece of dirt, fiber, and dried oil can be seen. Most important, if a jewel were damaged, we'd see that too. I think the benefits of illumination from underneath are clear in this video footage. I like this particular video light for several reasons, and I'll put my Amazon associate link below if you'd like to buy one. First, it's small and it lays perfectly flat. Plus, it has this little ridge around the top, so if you put a part on it, it won't roll off. Second, it's rechargeable, so no power cords or batteries to change. Third, it easily attaches to a camera flash shoe or quarter 20 tripod mount, so it doubles as a standalone task light or camera mounted light. Here's an example of the light on my iPhone mount showing how a little fill lighting can make your subject pop. I've only started using this light on the microscope recently and I am so pleased with the results that I wanted to share it with the YouTube community. There's a little comparison. The idea was an offshoot from a conversation with Dayton on the YouTube channel I Shoot Watches, so I wanted to give him credit. I could end the program here, but I thought I'd give you some bonus video because this pony has a few more tricks. In addition to being able to adjust the color temperature of the white light to match either daylight or indoor lighting, this light also has an RGB mode and can be dialed in to any color. If you've watched my past videos, you'll have seen me using it to add some bling to my final product shots. I'm Mike, the channel is Watch With Mike, and I hope you found this video enlightening. What? Would you rather I said illuminating?